you drive by them every day. Many of these signs look like they're in perfectly good condition. So why replace them? We're, we're upgrading the signs and the posts, uh, both for safety and maintenance reasons. The most recent sign replacement project is on M72, running through Kalkaska, Grand Traverse, and Leelanau counties, and on M115 in Benzie County. They're replacing 1,800 signs for more than $500,000. You know, posts, uh, metal or wood, uh, degrade over time, and we bring them up to uh, current standards, brand new posts, break away, so that they're as safe as possible. Many of the steel posts are being replaced with wood, MDOT engineers say they are sturdier to withstand our harsh winters. And when a uh, snow truck goes through, picks up a lot of snow and pushes it up against those signs, those metal signs don't hold up as well as a wood post would. And in the event of a crash are safer than steel due to a breakaway system. Or where a steel post might be struck by a vehicle and it can either be bent down and dragged underneath the vehicle causing more damage or it can be bent up against the car and up against the windshield, and that causes a big danger. How much does this change cost? For a basic route sign, it costs $26 for steel and $57 for wood. It's, it's definitely worth it. Uh, every year we have to replace a lot of uh, metal post signs just because you know they do get damaged in the winter with the plowing. And then obviously there is a little bit of a safety benefit with the wood posts.